Research on the Sonic Oscillator, not going very well. But that's okay, it should still be done, I don't know, sometime next month probably. Not too worried about it. I could build another lab and get another 50 scientists and get 100 dudes working on it. That would guarantee that gets done fast, as well as the ships. But I just don't feel like spending that much money on 100 scientists, because that gets expensive. So, we'll um, ooh, not build a new base. We'll hold off on that. I do have 27 Aquanauts total, so I could send over uh, a squad of 14 Aquanauts over to the Asia base. That would leave me with two spare at USA, which uh, hmm, I don't think would actually work because we have a few injuries. So yeah, we have we have a lot of injuries. And Wheatley. Name will be fixed. So, yay. I do need to pick up a, another person. We need a KPO Zobo the second, I believe. And then we need to get Werelax in there. So I'm going to be picking, bleh, be picking up more soldiers anyway. We'll go for, I don't know, eight? Eh, maybe? Not sure. We're making a bunch of armor still. Plastic Aqua armor, not the magnetic iron because we're out of the ZR bite, basically. Um, we're running low. Uh, I'm not I'm not happy with how much we have. We do have a good amount, but keep in mind this is the fuel source for the ultimate craft, so definitely hanging on to what we've got. And is there anything I can sell? I think I Yeah, I think I skipped doing this last time. Fifty seven sonic pulsers. Let's sell some of those. Don't need that many. I'll hang on to a bunch, but 11 launchers, 37 bombs, 8 disruptor pulse launchers, 25 ammo for it. Hmm. Uh, I think I can sell all of these because we're working on the oscillator, so fuck it. We don't really need them. 26 sonic cannons is quite a good bit. Thai grenades, med kits, thermal tasers, magnet blast grenades, get rid of those. Torpedoes, yep, still hanging on to those. Uh, DUP head, Ajax, don't need any of this anymore, because we're rocking the... No, no, no. We're not done with the oscillator yet. Hang on to that. Whew, that would have been bad. Still working on the oscillators. Aside from that, it looks to be okay. No MC readers or anything? At all? Okay. 409 plastics. Hmm. I would have thought I'd have um, some form of mind control stuff by now, but guess not. Like MC readers and such. Oh well, one million through sales. That's fine. And I don't think we need anything for the Triton since we basically pick it up off the field as we're using alien tech. Yeah, it looks good. Could probably do with some more pistol power clips one day. Might actually have to manufacture that. Yeah, I'm happy with this, I think. And then again, armor, but we're making more, so I'll, I'll check that out afterwards. So, hoping for... Not that. Alien Interdiction, though. A very small survey ship. So, I think Alien Interdiction is the whole... Uh, getting the humans to sign a pact with the aliens, and that'll lose them as a funny nation for you, which is kind of a big deal. And I think that's I think that's alien interdiction, and this is just the first stage of it. So hopefully we can shoot it down South Pacific. So we will see if Barracuda 2 from Asia can get it. Otherwise, we'll wait a bit too deep. I hate that message. Just keep chasing it, God. Uh, keep chasing it. And then it's going to be running out of fuel soon, so we'll send the USA Barracuda over. If we can. Alright, and you're out of fuel. That's why USA's there! I think he was going north a bit. There he is. He's probably still too deep. Nope, we're good now little shit. We'll probably just blow him out of the mm, water. Boom. Destroyed. That's good, though. It's a very small, so it's not really worth doing anyway. Alien interdiction. Those are the things you want to shoot down, I'm pretty sure. But there's a chance that they're going to be sending um, dreadnoughts and stuff to look for me. 
as uh, as I start to piss them off more and more. And there is the, in my opinion, probably the best because of how much ammo it has, ship weapon. There's one that is stronger. It uses the pulse with torpedo technology, but I'm pretty sure the ammo for that is incredibly limited. But there we go, sign defenses too, if you happen to care enough. I don't know why you would though. And then I think ZR bite is what we need to do next. Bunch of corpses and the squad leader. Mm. MCA lab, alien and implanter, just a bunch of flavor shit. Yeah, I think we gotta do ZR bite here one of these days. Get rid of. I can't remove that. Um, yeah, we'll do ZR bite. And I think this will unlock the um, disruptor pulse launcher that we've got, because I'm pretty sure we don't know how to use that. Okay, how much armor do we have now? How much do we need? I want to check that. We do have Disruptor Pulse Launchers. Do we know how to use them? Those are different questions. Seven sets of armor on spare. Trident equipment. I cannot put the Disruptor Pulse Launcher on, so we do not know it as a technology. So we do need to research that somehow, and I'd imagine ZR, but it's probably a precursor to it. So we have, yeah, seven spare suits. So looks like... Looks like we have enough for a squad here, but not enough for a second squad. But Sonic Oscillators come first in my opinion, so we will stop production of that completely. Sonic Oscillator requires ZR, but pretty good amount. And I need at least four. I think I need six. No, just, just four for now. Eventually need six, but we'll just do the four. That's fine. It'll be done in about three days, and we can continue on the armor. Floating base attack. There they are. They're looking for us now. They're pissed off. They're upset that we shot down their, uh, their big ship that they were up here with, and then we shot down this guy over here, and they're just like, Oh, God, where are they? Fucking hell. Please shoot it down. It's gonna scout out my Africa base. No. No, you, you have to shoot this guy down. bothers me when they skirt that close to the base because there's always that chance that they see you like that may have not been the mission he was probably looking for this guy up here but if they see this guy i'm pretty sure that'll still work just as well and they send endless dreadnoughts at us until we eventually die i'm pretty sure and maybe that's only if you shoot it down with defenses i don't remember anywho we have new people so we've got kpo the second i'm pretty sure we're on the second might be the third not 100 sure on that and we have Werelax in here as well as the Freebies Gilgamesh, Revokas, Sphinx, CTP, Midas, Happy Hippie Hippo, and Rollerbot. So we do still have a lot of freebie names to go through, but obviously I'm not going to be hiring like 80 Aquanauts. Um, that's way expensive. I've made that mistake before in the past where I'm just like, everybody gets a soldier immediately. And no, you can't do that. It gets ridiculously expensive. So I'm, I'm going to pass on that. And Seneca Oscillator's done right away. Nice. So back on the armor then. Uh, there we are. I probably could start on the magnetic iron armor, but mm, I'll just 30. Why not? It'll take a month. It's fine. So equip the Barracuda with the oscillators. Mm, 100 ammo. Mm, basically infinite. Oops. TUP head. Uh, we need to transfer those over. To Asia. Cool. And then sell off the DUP head torpedoes, the launcher, the Ajax. Don't need these anymore. Thank you. 
Should be getting a terror mission here pretty soon. And there that is. Oscillator, oscillator. Good. Even have a few medkits there. Believe them for now, though. Yeah, they don't have. They only have ten technicians. Probably get more. Get a few more. Another ten. And terror mission. They'll pay for themselves really quickly. Nothing, nothing. Nothing at all. So everybody's happy. Uh, funding change plus 900,000 and a 2,700 monthly rating, which is really, really good. Um, taking down that dreadnought was a pretty phenomenal thing for us. That was about a thousand score right then and there. And a couple things we destroyed, and that would be about 3,000, I think. But the uh, the base that's down there is, well, still causing issues. And we're doing just well enough in the area that they haven't completely turned against us yet. That'll be coming soon, though, I'm pretty sure. So that brings us up to $1.2 million, so we're almost... I think we're like just breaking even as far as money goes. Yeah, because we're making 7.6, that's about 4.5 there. 1.2, so that brings us up to like 5.7. And we'll just call that 6 million, so we're apparently profiting like a million? Oh, I bought those uh, scientists right away, so yeah. I was down to like 300,000 or something, I'm pretty sure. Oh, hmm. These aren't these aren't fun ones. Um, that's an artifact site. I don't like these at all. In fact, um, enough that I really don't want to do it, and I just want to say fuck it. We had a good month, and just not do it. Gonna need some decent people for this. You're still wounded. Oh, uh, we have so many rookies. Okay, well. Let's take you folks off. Get some get some young blood in there. Alright. So we have, we have Rada on as the medic. Okay. So pistol, grenades, the cannons. We have the team rocket, question mark. Betuer, 99er. No, no team rocket. Let's get Vivian on there. Vivian hasn't had any action for a little while. There we go. So that's a torpedo launcher. Four small torpedoes should kind of sort of be okay. Ten kits, it's fine. Chemical flares, I think maybe it gets a little dark there. Not sure. Might be arriving in the nighttime anyway. Alright, god. And then make sure everybody who's on the Triton gets their armor. Sniper's getting the magnetic. What are all the spare suits that we have lying around now? This is great. We'll go there and we'll try it out, but if it becomes sort of a slaughter, I'm gonna leave. It's a two-part mission. Much like the shipping routes, the first part is kind of a just fucking run for the teleporter thing to get to the next session. And then the next bit is a go destroy that thing part. And it's a right on a freshly activated alien communications site. There are two levels to the site, as I just said. A seabed with its alien pyramids and a hidden alien complex. Get all the aquanets to the entrance of the complex and click the abort mission button to proceed. That'll bring me to the next part, which is where we go and destroy a uh, the device, the, the actual communication device, I'm pretty sure. Uh, you can very easily, fairly, it's kind of sort of just run for it and blow it up with a grenade. Uh, I've had luck with that in the past. I 
would prefer not to rely on that though as it is dangerous and relies very 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 heavily on your starting position during that second part looks like time minutes are good on everybody i did leave behind a few things um the flares because we apparently don't need that minutes today to have enough and a couple pulsers shouldn't be much of an issue and going through this remembering exactly what i'm fighting here i'm pretty sure it's I'm pretty sure it's to Soth and Tentaculates on the first part, maybe the Squidly things. Uh, and then the second part is mostly to Soth and Tentaculates, I'm pretty sure. There might be Aquatoids around here and there, but uh, just in case, because I'm not 100% sure. Vladdy, unload your gun, and... Somebody else was also a bit terrible with mind control. Was it Super Ronzilla? I want to say Super Ronzilla. really the only name I'm recognizing. You're gonna unload your gun too, just for safety. If we end up needing you, you can load your gun again, that's fine, but if you become under alien control, I, uh, I can't have you stirring up shit, so. We'll take it pretty slow, as usual. We have... Ooh, the teleporters are right there. So good. And something up there. Can we... They can hit her from here. I think it might be a Desoth. Okay, I don't like that position. Let's see if we can do... I guess 24 strength, not very good. 37 strength, that's pretty good. Get you to do it. Young Venus, I'm pretty sure you have a couple grenades. You do. Prime it. Toss it over to him. Get up and hook it. That may or may not do it. If it's a Soth, it might live, it might die. It's kind of a coin flip. So we'll try again. There's another one. You're not that accurate. 40 firing accuracy. Holy hell, terrible. Even for a rookie. That's bad. Roller bot, standing aim shot 42, but puts us in really bad grenade positions. So just go for a snapshot and fall back. Oh my god. Ooh. Actually like to have you fuck. I was gonna say I'd actually like to have you closer to the door kneeling so we don't have to go as far out to get this guy. Uh, but it doesn't matter, nobody can hit him anyway. He's gonna throw a grenade and kill two people this turn. We got up back here. Nothing yet? Alright. Another building there that we could use for cover. These are multi-storied and they will shoot out the tops, so obviously taking it incredibly cautiously. I feel like it got really lucky just then. And he is still there, and it is a Tassoth. Ah! Right on the inner thigh. Well done. And we don't see that guy anymore, huh? Let's see about Rollerbot. Oops. Ah, shit. Next turn. Run, in case grenades. Hmm, there's two up there. Interesting. So did he just like run up and across? Perhaps. Okay, well, uh, Operation Just Run For It is going to commence here in a moment. This is, it's seriously, it's kind of suicidal if you try to do a bug hunt and kill every single alien. You can do that and you sort of win by default by won't go into the second story, but when the elevator's right there, just go for it. Uh, because mind control and all that, it's horrible stuff. 